What's up, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll show you how you can fix the GPU error that you may be getting when you're starting up Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. The simplest answer to save you watching this video is update your graphics drivers. If you're not sure where to start, well, that's where the rest of this video will take you. First of all, you'll need to know if you have an AMD or an NVIDIA graphics card, as well as what it is. The simplest way to see is by hitting start and typing in info, then we'll open system information. We'll then look on the left for components, expand by clicking the plus next to it. Then we'll head down to display, click this, and you'll see next to name, the name of the graphics card you currently have. Mine is a 3080 Ti from NVIDIA. This first section will cover updating your NVIDIA driver. The second section will cover updating your AMD driver. So skip forwards, depending on what you have. To update an NVIDIA graphics card, you can either use NVIDIA GeForce Experience, assuming you have an NVIDIA account and you signed in. Otherwise, you can download the latest version from the NVIDIA website and install it that way. I just prefer this method overall. You can search for download NVIDIA driver, click the first link or click the link in the description down below. We'll then enter the kind of product that we have. For me, I'll enter GeForce, then 30 series, 3080 Ti, Windows 11, and I'll click search. Then I'll click download and the NVIDIA driver should then download upon clicking the last button here. Then we can click on it to open it when it's done and follow through the installation process. Do note that you should have the game closed while you're doing this as it may break a lot of things, causing you to need to restart if you update your driver with the game running. Let's assume you have an AMD card instead. You can search for update AMD driver and click the first link or head across to the next link in the description down below. All we need to do here is search for our card or graphics solution from the product list over here. Say graphics and on the right hand side, we'll look for the correct series, say maybe the R9 series, R9 Fury and maybe R9 Fury here. Anyways, whatever graphics card you have, you'll need to select whatever it is from the list here with series and finally whatever the correct version and model combination of it is. When you've selected the correct combination and you've selected your card at the very end, click submit and right after that, we can choose what edition of Windows we have to download the update for. In my case, I'll need to download Windows 10 64-bit and we can download the Adrenaline edition over here, which is the gaming version of the driver by clicking download. If you're using, say, Windows 11 and you only see Windows 10, don't worry, that version will work for Windows 11. They just haven't named another version for Windows 11. It's practically the same thing anyways. All you need to do then is open the installer when it's done downloading, follow through these steps, and just like that, when you fire up the game the next time, you won't be receiving that error anymore. Once again, the game should be closed when you're updating your graphics drivers, otherwise some very funky things can happen. You may need to restart your PC when everything's done, and then things will go back to normal. You shouldn't be receiving the graphics driver error anymore. Anyways, that's really about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name is Techno here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.